All right, guys. So I did already pick a winner for my Sammy Andrus little discovery kit giveaway, where if you enter the giveaway, you can win three decants. Uh, those have already been shipped. The winner was Randy Minter. So congratulations, Randy. I appreciate your subscribing to the channel, watching the channel, and entering the giveaway. I will have another giveaway coming up very, very soon. Uh, in which I'll probably send out some more decants. So keep watching, and hopefully you guys can win the next one, or maybe Randy will win again. So. All right, guys, before we begin with the review, I want to remind you guys to subscribe if you haven't already. Subscribe button's right down below. Push it and then push the little bell so you get notified when I have new videos coming out. And if you see anything in the video that you like, please give me a like. All those things help out the channel and help out the video. Okay, today we are talking Sammy Andrus and we're talking Red Sapphire. This one is awesome very very nice fragrance so you are going to get a 30 mil bottle it's gonna be a stock bottle your your label is going to wrap the side like that so three sides of the bottle I like how he does that your cap your atomizer they're gonna be like stock as well but they're really good see there very nice distribution That is so good. It's it's really good. If you guys haven't heard of Sammy Andrus, haven't tried Red Sapphire, I suggest just getting on there and buying you a bottle or three right now. You'll be happy. This is a very, very nice fragrance. Price tag on this, oh man, I forgot to look it up, but I believe it's 30 or less, like 30 bucks or less, somewhere around there. All of his fragrances are like around 30 or less. And that's for the one ounce 30 mil. I did get new glasses. I know that was an issue last time I did a Sammy Andrus review. To be able to see these notes on the back now, let's try them out. And I can. Saffron, almond, ambergris, amber wood, cedar, and jasmine. Boy, I was able to read those really well. Thanks, Doc. Got me some good eyeglasses here. Okay. So very very nice um, fragrance like i said on the opening you're going to pick up spice you're going to pick up the saffron you're going to pick up i think some of that cedar the ambergris i don't think it's like i don't think it's like overly done but you're going to pick it up as well very nice kind of spicy opening yeah really nice i think you pick up a little bit of that jasmine as well now when this thing dries down, you don't have as much spice in there, but you still have it. It does evolve a little bit. It doesn't evolve like into a totally different fragrance from the time you spray it to the time, you know, it's toward the end of its life. But you do have some, I guess, some small tweaks and adjustments as the fragrance dries down and we're getting toward the end. But you do pick up, you still get some of the spice, it's just not as heavy. Man, yeah, I just love this. So if you're really looking for it, you could pick up every single note that's on the back of this. That almond gives it a nice, smooth, kind of a smooth, almost like a creamy smooth underneath the spice. It's really good. You pick up that jasmine. Yeah, it, it, it's a really nice scent. So, yeah, you get the spiciness with those creamy, smooth, almondy undertones. And I think it's really done to perfection. I don't know if you could get much better than this. It's just a really good fragrance. Now, the the performance on this is it's good. It's, it's better than you would expect for what you pay for this. It is, it is really, really good. It outperforms most of the things in my cabinet. The performance, if you don't wash this off, you're going to smell it 24 hours later. I know, because I, I put it on one morning, 
I got really busy. It was just a long day. And I took my shower in the morning instead of in the evening. And I could still smell it on my skin 24 hours later. So that's pretty killer. Now it wasn't it wasn't performing like it did for the first 12 hours, but you could still pick it up. So if, if someone was close, you could pick it up, which you just don't find very many fragrances that have that type of performance, that has that type of longevity. The projection on this isn't going to be huge. Now, if you spray heavy, you're probably gonna fill up a room. But if you spray, I guess, couple here, maybe one here, something like that, three or four. You're going to have a pretty good scent bubble that's probably going to reach out about five to six feet. But if you go heavy, like I like to do sometimes, you'll fill up a room. And this this fragrance is one of those fragrances that, sure, why not? Go ahead and like throw extra sprays to fill up a room because it is that good. People are going to compliment you. People are going to ask, what are you wearing? Um, yeah, it is, it's a very, like, pleasing scent to most people, and it's an attractive scent. It's very, very well done. Now, if you are thinking or if you've thought of getting Baccarat Rouge 540, but you don't want to spend, what is it, like $400? I mean, get this. If you, even if you want to spend like 400 bucks, get a whole bunch of these, because in my opinion, I think this is better. I like it more. I like it more just based off of the scent, you know, me trying it out here and there, but I like this more. So it's good and it lasts forever. So this little bottle that you see, now I did decant some out of here for our uh, giveaway winner, but I bet you this thing lasts me my life, <laughs> the rest of my life. Well, I have a lot of fragrances, but because of how well it performs and how long it lasts, you're not having to reapply. You're not having to go heavy with it. Most of my does most of my designer things, I have to go like extra sprays, and then I have to reapply after six to eight hours. This one you don't, so it's going to last longer, and it, it's a fantastic fragrance. If you haven't checked out Sammy Andrus, I'd really suggest you do so. Uh, if you haven't checked this one out, this is one you could blind buy safely. Same with Blue Sapphire. Um, I haven't tried Purple Sapphire yet, but with Red and Blue, I can tell you, you can blind buy that and be happy. So check it out. Now, I will link Sammy Anders in the description, link to the website. So if you do want to check it out, you can pop that open and check it out. And if you place an order, he did give a coupon code for... The fragrance wardrobe subscribers and viewers is going to be m10 that will get you 10 percent off of your purchase and if you do spend 75 dollars or more you'll get free shipping on top of that so go and get you three bottles and put in the coupon code get your free shipping get 10 percent off and be well scented for a while Plus it's Christmas, or it's almost Christmas, so place those orders fast. You're gonna to need to do that so you can get it under the tree before the 25th. All right, guys, I appreciate you watching. Uh, please, if you liked anything in the video, please give it a like. If you are subscribed, I appreciate your loyalty to the channel. If you're not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Hit the subscribe button, I've already told you. All right, ring the bell for notifications. And I will catch you guys with the next video. Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas.